Yesterday, after a great New Year Eve celebration, he slept off. A very happy New Year to all my friends. Today, Jan 1st of 2022, we are in Monar. <laughs> Continuing with our Monar trip, first, let's go and have an awesome buffet from here, which is part of the complimentary breakfast. <laughs> Yesterday I forgot to mention about this hotel. The hotel is Clouds Valley Leisure Hotel, one of the beautiful hotels in Mona. It stays in the heart of the city. It is easily accessible guys. From here you can even witness the Kandandevan estate, tea estate, which is a scenic view. So we are taking the same route which we took yesterday wherein we went till the top station but today we are not going till top station but in between whatever we can cover we are going to cover today. We came to this photo spot which is in Devi Kulam, Grama Panchayat. On the way to the Kundala Dam we thought we will halt here take some beautiful pics look at the picturesque and photogenic spot. You cannot really go without taking a pic from here. We also took the instant photograph. After that, we will go towards the dam. We came to Matupati Dam. Here you can see a lot of shopping places. But the problem is here they have pedal boat which is only for two people and they are charging 400. But if you go a bit forward, that is towards Echo Point, you will get to see the Sun Moon Valley wherein you will get more options for boating. So we are going to that place. For parking, they are charging 10 rupees for two-wheeler and 20 rupees for four-wheeler. Finally, we reached Sun Moon Valley Boating and Recreation, which is in Matapetti Dam. It was opened on uh, 24th day of August 2015. Ticket charges goes like this: adult rupees 40, children 5 to 12, 20 rupees. Student they charge only 20. Still camera 50. Professional camera 60. This looks so beautiful, guys. There are so many options. Looks like not only the boat club. We have the children's corner, food court. Uh, I forgot to tell you one more thing. In the previous area, Matapati Dam, you also have the option for jet skiing. Sorry, we didn't check the rate. So if you guys are interested, you can also plan for that. We have the cowboy park here in Munnar, Matapati. Adult entry is 400 and child is 300. Family combo is 1200, which is for two adult and two children. And you have so many activities here. The rainforest, zip line, 12D cinemas, tire walk, tree climbing. Even for kids, they have a separate session of balloon shooting, archery, angry birds, etc. For boating, these are the options here. You have the speed boat, which is for four person, including children. And they are charging 910 rupees. And there is also a generic boat available which is per head 150. This can accommodate a total of 20 person including children. And what is this pontoon boat? 1,720, I think it looks like this. Speed boat is for 15 minutes and the family boat is for 30 minutes. Please make sure that you carry cash with you because they are not accepting any card payment or GPA. Also, we have to provide all our details, address, number, everything to them. So we have already taken the ticket for speed boat. Let's wait and see. Matupati Dam is a famous dam which is part of the Pallivasal Hydroelectric Project. Pallivasal Hydroelectric Project is the first hydroelectric project in Kerala. This project was commissioned in 1940. This was inaugurated by the former Raja Maharaja of Travancore, Sri Chitra Tirunal. We are entering into the speedboat! Yo!
came back amazing experience do try it out we reached kundala dam so you can find this bridge here and the regular buses also are traveling through this bridge so you can either park your vehicle on the other side of the bridge that should be better or on this side but it is very narrow on the other side so better you park while you entering itself you can see this beautiful view of dam so this is a spillway of the dam here also you can find boating this is actually a smaller version of the matupatti dam but the difference is that this is at a higher altitude it's a small one and a beautiful one so if you want to have an isolated boating area you can come here in case matupatti dam is crowded i have one more suggestion for you guys that is the vattavada village so it is around 20 kilometers from here if you get enough time i would recommend you guys to also visit vattavada village there you can see the farming like cabbage strawberry carrot etc so there also you can go stay there and experience an amazing feel one more suggestion is that you can plan to visit this dam on the way to top station so that you can save more time this spillway water is flowing towards matupatti dam so from kundala dam this water reaches matupatti dam that is how it is constructed special black pepper tea came to the scenic location echo point so the entrance fee is 10 rupees everywhere they are charging at least 10 rupees and uh, here also you will get the opportunity to do boating only pedal boating is available the peculiarity here is that if you scream it will echo whatever you are screaming that is why it is called echo point anju dev vlogs nothing <laughs> anju dev vlogs vlogs Love. <laughs> Actually, you should come with a bunch of people, and then you have to scream. You will definitely hear the echo. So today's trip, towards half of the day, we completed the same route which we took yesterday. Came back to the hotel. We also had lunch in between while coming back. Hope you understood the itinerary. So in the same route, what all you guys get to see is covered. yesterday and today on the same route there are few places which we couldn't cover if you like to cover you can definitely add it on to your itinerary those places are vattavada village which i already informed you on the place where you can see the vegetable farming fruits farming etc second place is karmelgiri elephant park so if you have children with you they might really enjoy because they provide elephant rides for 400 per head so that also if you get time you can definitely plan in your itinerary one more place is the tea factory which you can go and visit if you have never been to a tea factory so that will also be interesting we have already visited similar tea factory while in oti the link to that video i will provide in the description box we are already done with that particular route So we thought we will take another route for the second half of today that is towards Marayur Kantallur but we are not going till there today maybe tomorrow we will cover that side but for today we will see which side or which spot from that side we can cover so join us let's continue the trip Dears we came half way towards Anamudi peak but see the situation here see the climate it is raining heavily and uh, we are not prepared to face so much of rain and fog we didn't expect so <laughs> we will have to go back and tomorrow we will come back to the same route okay until then let's see wait and watch as it was raining while we tried to reach anamudi peak we came back we came back to the monar town and came to the csi church which is very famous and is an ancient architecture here there is no rain at all see the miracle but it's okay anyways tomorrow we will go towards that direction and see whatever we missed to see today now we are going inside the csi christ church look how amazing the architecture is the ancient architectures are like this 
it will be fabulous so we will go inside so we will go pray for some time come back definitely an amazing feel guys when we went inside so if you are here i would recommend you to come to this side as well because it is such a bliss and a peaceful area even if you are not going inside the church you can even come here sit here for some time and have a very nice time see the history of church written here csi christ church this beautiful church at the hill top of munar also known as kashmir of the south is an architectural symphony of god's own country and the history of this church begins in november 1894 just imagine how old this church is and see that is why such a beautiful architecture we are getting to see here and then we'll do some shopping and then we will go back to the hotel and see you from day 3 that is from tomorrow